Hi, this is Kent Sanders from The Artist's Suitcase at artistsuitcase.com and I want to take just a second today to show you how to use Evernote to set up a task list or really a list of any kind. So what I do first of all, specifically to use this for a task list system, is you notice over here on the left I have my task list set as the very first notebook and so I have it titled 01 Tasks and the reason for that is so it shows up first in this whole list of notebooks or notebook stacks. So uh, I like for it to show first of all because I access it a lot. I also create a shortcut up here to a specific note called tasks, but here I just want to show you the notebook called tasks. So a notebook and a note, two different things. Notebook contains lots of notes. A note is just one individual single note or single item. So first of all, I'm going to create a new note in the notebook called tasks. Okay, I'm going to title it task list or you can title it whatever. And here you can enter your tasks a couple different ways. You can create a bullet list if you want to, like task 1, task 2, etc. You can also use the numbering system. Task 1, task 2, or you can use these little check boxes, which is pretty cool. Task one, task two, task three, etc. And then as you go throughout your day, you can check these off if you need to, or however you want to use that. So that's a very helpful thing. And you can also, um, if you have a Mac or have another computer or device that you can use speech to text, you can, like here, I'm just going to hit the command key twice on my Mac, and it will recognize my speech. Task 1, new paragraph. Task 2, new paragraph. Task 3. Okay, so you can record tasks a lot of different ways. Now you can use this for lots of different kinds of things. Okay, for instance, you can set up, uh, you can set up, let's say, a prayer list. You can set up uh, an equipment list. You can set up shopping list, uh, you can set up a song list, you can set up a personnel list, basically anything that you would need a list for, you can create this in Evernote. Now the advantage of this, uh, of using a task list in Evernote, is that it's always available right there. If you use a mobile device, like I use an iPhone, if you have an iPad or tablet or whatever, you've always got those lists with you, which is obviously a very handy thing. So. I don't like to use a separate app for a task list just because it complicates things. I use Evernote for pretty much everything that involves any kind of information. Um, so that's a very handy way to keep track of your task lists. Now a couple more things here. One thing, one thing that you can do, let's say, uh, let's go back to this main task list, is that you can set a reminder. So I could set a reminder for, let's say, uh, tomorrow at 8 a.m. And then what will happen when you set that reminder, a notification will pop up on your phone and also on Evernote. So you notice that it's just created this in the list of your reminders. A notification will pop up on your phone or here in Evernote just telling you when that thing is due. So it's kind of like an alarm that you can set for that task if you want to use it that way. Also you can share this particular note or this task list with somebody. You can post it different places on social media. You can email it or you can copy and share a link which is pretty handy. Now one more thing um, here that I want to show you is, okay, I'm going to sync this first and then I'm going to show you on my phone how this works. So let me first bring up my phone right here, okay. This is a mirror of my iPhone. I go to my Evernote app. Okay, if I go down here to notebooks and I hit 01 tasks, you can see that all these things that I've just put in here are synced. And you can see over here on the left, these are the same things that are appearing here on my iPhone. So if I open up this task list, you can see it looks identical to what is over here on the left. And so you can you know, put a check mark there, you can uh, delete things if you want to. You can 
uh, add things with the uh, speech to text. For instance, let me do this on my phone. This is an added task, new paragraph. This is yet another added task, new paragraph. Okay, so you can see how that works very easily. Okay, so that's going to sync. Let me get out of this. And let me take this off of here. Okay, so when I sync this, okay, so there it's synced up. So those are, those are some ways that you can use Evernote for it's just a very simple task list or really a list of any kind. Thanks for watching and hopefully this is helpful to you. Thanks.